So one of my friends uh, had a uh, pocket watch that uh, used to work, but uh, since it broke, uh, they decided to tear out its guts and make uh, artwork with it. Uh, they left the pocket watch itself with me, and uh, I took the empty shell and stuck a circuit board in it. Uh, this is right here has a Densitron display and a uh, little LED light, uh, an accelerometer in it, threw in a little watch battery, I'll see what I can do with it, and an AVR. I love AVRs. So what I did is I just wrote a little program that'll wake it wake up and use the accelerometer and the display and it has access to the LED. It's programming right now using a little uh, the tiny programmer and uh, yes it's potted in silicone. No it does not have acetic acid and I'm using a flexible flat cable to, uh, to get access to it directly. So what I have right here is the y-axis. So you can see as I rotate it this way, the number decreases. As I rotate it the other way, the number increases. And uh, in the middle, it's around uh, two zero hex. So now it's centered. Notice that I have this in the wrong place, so it doesn't quite sit flat. I'm going to be re-spinning the board soon. This is all a single layer. And um, you can see the next one is a time since tap, which you'll see in a moment, and then the last number is this counter. So I have an interface for which I can increment. I can say two, three, four, five, ah, three, two, one, zero, and I can tap and it knows when I tap and I can use that as an interface and I've mapped uh, function number two up to the LED and I'm going to see what else I can do with this.